We're talking about what is trending okay. on Twitter. This is really cool, Brandon. Okay, listen to this. A woman found the world's most talented selfie snapper because she misplaced her iPhone. So last New Year's Eve, this is a year ago, Danielle mm. Brockman's phone went missing. A month later, selfies of a mysterious man started appearing on her iCloud. Do you know what iCloud is? No, but no, keep going. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I figured you didn't. I'll just, we'll go past that. I'll explain that during That's the commercial another story, break. That's yeah. a whole other Twitter <laughs> segment. Well, rather than delete the photos, she began recreating the man's photos with the wow. help of stick-on mustaches and impressive face-twisting skills. She documents her selfie shenanigans on a Tumblr page called My Cloud Pal, which you don't get what that is, and it launched last week. Kind of like Instagram. Which I don't really know what that iCloud is. iCloud is where you hold everything. You can yeah. hold pictures so he, and information. He's, but he's got her phone. Right? He's got her phone, but here's she has her phone hooked up to iCloud. Oh, so that so way he's it's posting like, all these pictures for her. But they're saving in her account. Right. But that's still theft, so someone might identify him. Yeah, I'm surprised. I mean, she's got this whole blog and everything, so mm -hmm. I'm thinking somebody must know who he is, right? <laughs> <laughs> At least she's, you know doing something interesting Didn't we? It. We took a selfie this morning. We did. We took our first selfie of 2014, and I tweeted it out. Okay. So if uh, you want to follow us on Twitter, Brandon, have you tweeted yet this morning? No. Okay, you have to do your first tweet of We're, the new year. Like, Happy New Year or something. Whatever like you want to tweet. Okay. Okay, you can go deal. do that right now. I'll, do, I'll, <laughs> I'll tweet a picture of you anchoring. Oh. What? Okay. There you go. <laughs> well, don't forget, you can chat with Brandon or any of us. We're on Twitter and Facebook this morning.